Hi guys, welcome back. Today I am going to review Hawkeye's episode 3. So we saw in the second episode's last scene that Clint is kidnapped and Kate gets caught trying to save Clint. The third episode starts with a flashback of how Maya grew up. Maya is a deaf girl and she also doesn't have her right leg from below the knee. She grew up in a normal school and her father ran a martial arts club. He also taught her to learn and to try to use her senses and awareness to her full potential. Her father probably was involved in some gang and when Clint was Ronin, Maya saw Ronin kill her father. And that is the reason why she is looking for Ronin so desperately. She interrogates Kate and Clint and she also tries to kill Kate as she thinks that Kate is associated with Ronin. And then they get into a fight. Kate and Clint are able to escape and steal a car to run. They are also chased by the gang. It is clear that Maya has a vendetta against Ronin, but there is clearly someone behind her, who will be seen in episode 4. We also get to see some great action in this episode, as Clint lets Kate use some trick arrows, and Kate is also really excited to use them. They are seen using puddle arrows, explosion arrows, and when they are trapped from both sides on a bridge, they also use a Hank Pym arrow, and are able to escape by jumping with a harness arrow on a train. Then Kate takes Clint to her house. In the ending scene, Jack, who is the fiancé of Kate Bishop's mother, points the Ronin sword on Clint when Clint is roaming Kate's house. So guys, if you enjoyed, please like, comment, share and subscribe if you're new. Thank you.